and you're almost live in a Woodland Park with more for us, Andrew. That's right, Tamsin, and it was a significant advisory that impacted nearly 270,000 residents and lasted nearly 50 days. And the reason why it was issued in the first place is because of what happened here in Woodland Park at the New Street Reservoir. As you can see behind me, it is an open water reservoir, which allows it to easily flood. The plan now is to close it. After seven weeks of boiling her water, whether it was to cook, bathe, or serve her two chihuahuas, Clifton resident Susan Donner is ecstatic to hear that the widespread boil water advisory in effect in Passaic County has finally been lifted. She called the past few weeks a nightmare. You go to the bathroom, I can't wash my hands, you know? Um, your whole life is affected by it. It was back on September 2nd when the Passaic Valley Water Commission issued the advisory after torrential rainfall from Tropical Storm Ida caused a runoff that contaminated the New Street Reservoir in Woodland Park, which serves Passaic, Clifton, and Patterson. The flooding came down from the mountain and into the reservoir. Uh, it turned it into what looked like a mud pit. A mud pit that officials say had to be drained. More than 52 million gallons in the reservoir replaced. All of it flushed through 550 miles of pipes through 4,000 fire hydrants. After running numerous tests on the water, officials got the all clear this week. Now they're working to make sure it doesn't happen again. Mayors from Patterson, Passaic and Clifton on the ground Friday, once again advocating for a plan that would cover the reservoir. It's an ongoing debate that in the past has been challenged by opponents concerned with what the commission described as aesthetic concerns. We get it. We understand that individuals who bought homes and property and for the local officials, these are issues that that ring strong. Further delay means further damage. And quite frankly, I don't care what it looks like. We care what it tastes like. According to the commission, over 700 open reservoirs were in use across the United States in 1975. Today, only six remain in the country. Five of them are in New Jersey. The time to make the fix, they say, is now. It's 2021. To allow this to occur in today's day and age, it's ridiculous. Now, the estimated cost to make this closed reservoir happen is about $120 million. A timeline remains unclear. Now, one good news that came from this whole situation is that the commission out here in Passaic County recognized the hardships of many of the customers. So they are offering a $25 credit. That will be appearing in their November statement. For now, we are live in Woodland Park. I'm Andrew Ramos, PIX11 News. Well, it is something, Andrew, thank you.